Hi, and welcome to this tutorial on Panachute. In this tutorial, we will show you how to connect Panachute to your home network to allow you to simultaneously connect to Panachute and to the internet. This is necessary to allow you to upgrade your Panachute firmware. Step one is connecting to your Panachute module. Simply connect Panachute to one of the available jacks at the base of the Panagear, and then uh, power on the Panagear. Wait a few seconds and test the joystick on the uh, Panachute module and ensure that the connection is solid and that the batteries are operable. Once that's done, search for the Panachute module on your available networks and connect to it. In step two, we want to connect Panachute to your wireless network router. To do this, open your internet browser and connect to the Panachute module by typing in the uh, default IP address 192.168.245.1 or typing in the URL panachute.com. The URL panachute.com only works when you are connected directly to the Panachute module. Once the Panachute user interface is loaded, we want to go to the configuration menu and go to the Wi-Fi uh, submenu and scan for the available wireless networks. Then we want to select our wireless network and in this case, I'm logging on to Aridum, my home network. Once we're connected, the wireless router will assign an IP address to our Panachute module. We want to wait about 10 seconds for this process to complete. Once it's complete, we'll refresh our browser. In the next step, we want to obtain the IP address assigned to the Panachute module by the network. Once the browser is refreshed, we'll return to the configuration menu to find the IP address uh, assigned to the Panachute module by the network. And as you can see here, it's 192.168.1.131. We'll want to copy this IP address for future reference. The next step is to reconnect to our wireless network and then connect to our Panachute module simultaneously. We return to our available Wi-Fi network and then reconnect to our home network. Once we're reconnected to the home network, we'll return to the browser and type in the URL address to connect to the Panachute module. As you can see, we will now be able to connect to the Panachute module and our home network simultaneously. Next, we will want to test this connection. The simplest way to do this is to test the joystick function in the user interface. Begin by activating the joystick and then testing various movements to see if they are being relayed by the wireless router to the Panachute module. As you can see in the camera feed here, our commands are being relayed to the Panachute module and from the Panachute module to our motorized mount. Now that we are connected to our home network and our Panachute module simultaneously, we can initiate automatic firmware upgrades and connect to our Panachute module remotely from anywhere in the world. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please feel free to email me at adam at panachute.com. Thank you.